extra minutes. Your mum and dad are such nice people. I didn't have the heart to say to them, what if something goes wrong? Yes. Yeah, look, it, and the whole time for two years, it's been our absolute number one priority is safety. You want to see that this is successfully completed. And look, mum and dad have been a part of that. They're a part of the team. I've got a kid your age, and I'm still not quite sure how I'd feel. <laughs> but I'm starting to worry for you. <laughs> Though it is beautifully planned. It is, and I think that's, you know, it's, uh, it's all about, you know, people say, uh, all sorts of things about your preparation. If you if you have uh, fantastic preparation, you'll have a fantastic performance. And well, it's an object lesson, isn't it? When I flew down with you, our crew car drove through the night and hit a cow. That's exactly right. See, so we were, we were much safer than they were. <laughs> no, flying is. I had a better yeah. driver. <laughs> That's <laughs> fly, flying is very safe. It's um, you know it's it, the one thing about aviation. There's no room for uh, complacency, and you know I think that's your number one priority. Make sure that you. Know, you know your limits and, and you, you train, you make sure you're trained well and, and you're planned well and I think that, I hope and I think it will all go well. Tell me what you did in order to get flying lessons. You know, I found out that you know, I could fly solo on a 15th birthday and I set that goal. If, if this other guy could do it, why couldn't I? Uh, I then got a job at the Pambula supermarket. Um, you know, my boss Daryl, I was on $7.65 an hour and, and I worked an hour and 45 minutes, three nights a week after, after school. school. After school. And, and he was a good boss, he paid me for two hours. So between that and washing a truck on the weekend, uh, I had the money every fortnight to do an hour's flying. So you funded yourself into a pilot's life? Basically, I, I got uh, quite a long way and then a friend from the Frogs Hill Aero Club recommended I uh, go for an AOPA uh, pilot scholarship, and which I did. You know, So it is, it's, it's a long road, but you know, if you want it bad enough, you'll do it.